but I am good to go. Let's bring this up. How's things looking, guys? Just to make sure it's looking all right. Hmm. No, no, no. That's pretty good. Okay. Now we're bring up the game. And how is everybody today? this up shall we? Yes. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune. You know, when the first announced, I was like, well, What? <laughs> the fact that Telltale is even working with Borderlands is actually a great idea. Mysterious alien treasure troves filled with adventure and incredible power. Vaults, the people call them. Vaults. The secret announced was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. Vault Hunter. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer. Though his methods could be seen as somewhat unsportly. Yeah, I'll just murder everybody. He ran the corporation Hyperia and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. Mm -hmm. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack. But forget the adventurers who risk it all for less. Ah, obvious the rewards. Hmm. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Ah, let's get this started. Quick second, I want to make sure I have something figured out. Alright. There we go. How's the stream looking, guys? And how's the sound sound? Some sort of radiation leak, I don't know. <laughs>
Where exactly are we going? I ask the questions. Okay, then uh, do you mind asking yourself where you're taking me? Where are we going? Straight. Oh! Oh, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. (laughs) Is that what this is about? (laughs) Look. Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smartass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh... From the beginning. Right. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the baddest guy of them all. It must feel good to find to be just like him. Take it, it's yours, right? (laughs) I mean, you always said that. (laughs) Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but uh, but hey, here we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends... I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. And I figure I could get lunch. Seems like a good place to start. Well, then we're starting with three of whatever's most expensive. Sure. And wine pairings. For lunch? We're gonna get twisted, bro. If I'm not puking up $500 in food and alcohol this afternoon, then we are doing it wrong. (laughs) We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because... You made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mind deal we put together. Hey, hey, hey. We made it. Okay? We're in this together. If I'm moving up, we're all moving up. You can be certain of that. I appreciate that, Reese. You know, people around here have short memories when it comes to that stuff. You, me, Yvette, we're going to run this place. Yes, we are. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right. Yeah. There we go. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. <laughs> Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a sec. Uh, No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese, and if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick, so you might not have been in the loop. So where's Henderson? He, uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. 
And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. Because <laughs> I... Ah, this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. <laughs> it's destiny, Reese. And men... Real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. Mm -hmm. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. Oh, thank you. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps wow. dramatically make my point. Is Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me. So, uh, Are you buying this vault key, or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Mm. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. All right, let's... Ugh. Why do the biggest scumbags always have the best view? Oh, that should be yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, no, but... Only less... vasquez -y. <laughs> Do you want the money or not? Because I... Three years sucking up to the guy. Out the window. Literally. It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get... Yes. Yeah, that's what we had before. It's a working day, August, and I just got this promotion. No, no. Uh, look, 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 are you going... Why are you turning this into a whole thing right now? Not yet. Look, I'll have to call you back. I... Uh, what a waste. Such a nice suit. Yeah, 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 no, but... Do you want the money or not? Is that... Download and decrypt this file. Why are you trying to screw me on this? Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say hi to your mom. Damn it! Ah, oh, right. Now, uh, what were we talking about? Before we were so rudely interrupted. We were talking... <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. Duh. All right, your uh, promotion. Henderson 
was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. What? No. No, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. You can't humiliate me. I quit. Careful now, kid. The only way you quit Hyperion is the way Henderson did. You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can empty. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No. No, no. This can't be happening. I'm finished, Will. I'm finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it up. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. Because that is your job now, to clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something? I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? Well, just trying to lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's going to pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is its vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Yeah. Hold, please. Done. Yeah, done. I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone. Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, 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 right? hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. Yeah. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Uh, but, but, Look. It's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends! Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now, and when you get back. (laughs) Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. Yeah, I know the car. We 
leading up to the trap. Oh, never mind. I love the intro for the episode of this game. Oh, headshot. right there. Oh, crap. I think we... I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Yeah. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. Kind of. Probably not for long, though. So, what do we say if someone asks where we got the money? What do you mean? Well, I mean, what do we tell people? We should have a story. I, mean, I would prefer not to tell them that we stole it from Hyperion. That would not go over well. We just tell them the truth, that we stole it. How is that a good idea? Hey, we're on Pandora. Yeah. We'll actually get more street cred if it seems like we're bigger criminals than we are. Uh, okay, that makes sense. So, this looks not good. We got ourselves a show here. What are you looking at? It's Pandora. What did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have $10 million chained to me is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back planet nut jobs. I'm just getting a vibe, you know? What the hell are you afraid of, huh? It's just a town like any other with... A little more dust. What am I afraid of? Oh, I don't know. Uh, old mining community stranded on a planet, getting prospector madness and eating us for one. Listen, <laughs> one tap on the arm and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works, but it's definitely neat. Yeah, stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You and me, Yvette... I mean, we bring this key back, and they're going to make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it. Then it's kick back on the moon beach time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll pop champagne and everything after we get back with the key. Ah, come on. It's in the bag. Trackers beep beep beeping, but I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? No. Could ask one of them. They seem normal-ish. Normal-ish enough. A great idea. Anyway. What an excellent idea. I thought so myself. Pandoran with a Titan 
ass, make sure your toilet is tight and glass. That's, that's just, that's great. Do good. Tester and hospital. All right. All right. Let's not have this right. Slag off. Hey, you know, Grease Face. You know, the guy with the weird meat thing. You know where the world of curiosities is? Grease My buddy and I, we gotta be there, like, you know, right now. Say that again. Reese, what are you doing? Yeah, Reese. What are you doing? Repeat what you said. Just so there's no misunderstanding. What? You got a greasy face. Look, get some lotion, get some gel, do a wrap or something. I mean, if you want to lash out, you know, blame your jeans, it's not your fault. Oh, look, fella, uh, my friend is really, really sorry. He's got some kind of a condition where he says really stupid crap just to see what'll happen. This called me over the controller. You're Hyperion. You wake suckers ruin this town, you know that? Atlas were bastards, but at least they had the good sense to fail. When Jack came in, he turned everything to smoke. And it's you and assholes like you that made it happen. Look, man, we really don't know anything about that. Hey, little man. What's in the case? Hey, kitty cat, show us what's in the case. Okay, now, look, before we get all bent... Uh, oh. Is there, like, a convention or something? Oh. <laughs> Bandits. You know what we got here? Reese, do they... We got a couple Hyperion warmongers, gentlemen. The bot! Yvette, prime it! Already? Yep. Really? Just, uh, just give me the menu. Okay, but don't go bananas. These things ain't cheap. And do you know what we do with warmongers? Do you know what we do? Should we tell them what we do with Hyperion workers? Who is Butterbot deployed? Time to clock in. Listen, boys. You're gonna hand over that case, or you're handing over your heads. Your choice. Look, guys, let's talk about this. Uh... Ooh, got quiet all of a sudden. 